This is Eric Phillips, former professional actor and now full-time metal detectorist. For the last 25 years, he has lived in the Caribbean, on the island of Grand Cayman. As a child actor, Eric once starred in the sitcom with Phillips Family Values. He was famous for his catchphrase, why that's my middle name. Uh, plan is to hit the beach with the old metal detector, see what we can find, um, maybe find some nice treasure today. What are you hoping to find? Uh, well, most valuable stuff really, um, jewellery, uh, ancient artefacts, usual type of thing. Sunglasses are really good, yeah, yeah, you can usually sell those on. What's the most expensive thing you've ever found? Well, I uh, found a few expensive things over the years. Um, John Lennon's sunglasses, um, a tooth from the, the shark used in the Jaws movie, um, some of Long John Silver's gold doubloons. Wow, and what is the most money you've ever made from something that you've found? Oh, uh, oh loads, you know, usually sell it on for quite a lot. So you've got a, you've got a guy to sell your treasures to? Uh, he'll usually give me a good deal, so you know, I can take make like twenty dollars per item. Uh, I've got a piece of metal from Stephen Hawking's wheelchair. So, what are some of your treasures you found this week? Uh, so, over the last week, I've had quite a good haul, as you can see. Um, for instance, this is a Blackbeard's belt buckle. Uh, some, uh, a gold medal from the uh, London Olympics, 2012. Um, these are Tom Cruise's shades he used in Top Gun. Um, this, is a, this is a pair of scissors. That's actually my pair of scissors. Um, oh yeah, this is one of my favourites. This is the uh, this is a coat hook from the captain's bedroom on the Titanic. Uh, this is my favourite. This is Charlie Sheen's wine rack before his meltdown. Every day at eight a.m., Eric takes out his treasured metal detector. Quick kiss of his lucky necklace, then he goes through his morning ritual. Now he's ready to find some treasure. What, what do you love so much about a uh, metal detector? Oh, uh, many things. It's uh, the thrill of the hunt, the, uh, the excitement of the dig. You know, sometimes I really just feel like Indiana Jones, you know, running through that temple with that big ball behind him, you know, it's, like, it's exhilarating. All right, guys, wish me luck. Eric makes his living by selling his finds to his best friend and local hustler, K-Dog. Go on, go on, Eric Phillips. Hey, Kenrick, how's it going? 
going good. So what you got for me today, Bertrand? Uh, I got something really nice for you. Check that out. Wow. Oh, uh, so much you want for this, Bertrand? Oh, that's got to be at least 500. No, man. No, brother. This is about $2. $2? Mm. Okay, how about five? Since you've been working all day on the beach. Thank you very much. Good deal. Well, I know Eric for about 10 years now. And he does this every day. Every day. Every day is up and down on the beach. Do you ever find anything valuable? Yeah, man. Look at this. I pay $5 for this. I guarantee I can get 2005 for this. Don't work hard, work smart. Oh, that's my little name. Do you recognize that man? I think I do. He's from the 1980s sitcom. It was terrible. Now that was back then. Was it even funny? His name's Eric something. Looks like Eric found a treasure he didn't realize he was looking for. Lisa! Thank you.